what we're doing today is we're going to pull off the alternator on the Corvette and we're going to go ahead and um, make sure what the amperage is coming out of this thing because we might have to replace the voltage regulator in the alternator and the alternator is right here that's the alternator you can tell it's not original factory equipment because it has some remanufactured sticker on it it was like that when I bought the car and the reason we're doing this is because after a 50 mile round trip in this car the other day I parked it I let it sit for two days and I came out to start it and the battery was really drained kinda low so being as we know this is a new battery we're gonna go ahead and give some attention to the alternator so what we have to do to get the alternator off is disconnect the battery which is this nut right here and this nut right here and then we have to pull the serpentine belt off which is that belt that goes around all the pulleys right there and the way we do that is we get a half inch drive ratchet and then we stick it in that tensioner pulley over there I think we may have to take off the snorkel just to have better access to the the tensioner and the serpentine belt so we're gonna go ahead and get started on that and I want to get a little further I'll show you what's going on with this so far This nut right here, this one's a 13 millimeter. Make sure it fits on there nice and snug. This nut right here, that's a 10 millimeter. This one back here, this is a 10 millimeter as well. So let's go ahead and get this fat rascal down here off first. Go ahead and smack it and loosen it up so we don't break anything. Just to make sure we don't break anything, we'll go ahead and loosen it up by smacking it a little bit. Goes a lot faster with an air ratchet. But my air ratchet is pretty wimpy, so I'm gonna go ahead and use the 
regular ratchet. Here she comes. Here she is. Just like that. Some squeaking going on in there. But we're going to go ahead and take this apart and see if we can find some stuff that's wrong with it. So here we go. We're getting ready to take apart this alternator. And what you do when you take apart this alternator is you remove these three bolts. There's one, two, three. One, two, three. And be sure to scribe this right here, and right here, and right here, so you know where to put the thing back together just to make sure the components are in the right place. Take a scribe, you scratch a mark here, here, and here. So let's go ahead and take this apart.
There we go. To the eyes to part. Okay, it looks like we're just going to clean this one up. Um, it looks like it's a little bit kind of funky to pull that one off down there. I don't want to destroy anything. And I think, we're, we're, I think what we're going to do is we'll just clean this one up. 